Yo, what's going on YouTube, CJ Sauce here, and we're back with another Madden 22 video. In today's video, we're gonna show you the best free stocking stuffers you can get. These are free zero chill players. You can get the, you can get one of these guys for absolutely free. I'm also gonna go over my top five players and then the two masters at the end, and I'm gonna give you a sneaky tip at the end for the Patriots theme team specifically, and something to look out for if you're running any theme team. So make sure you stick through the video. If you guys didn't know, we're pushing for a thousand subscribers on the channel. We are dangerously close, and this is honestly something I didn't think that I'd be able to get when I started this goal. If I can hit 1,000 subscribers by Christmas, I will give away 12,000 MUP points to somebody who comments 1K on this video or any video I post between now and Christmas. I appreciate all the support on the videos lately and we're gonna keep grinding for you guys. Let's get into the video today. So I'm recording this the night before, but they've revealed every player. They've shown us the sets, how you can get them and all of that. So we're gonna recap very quickly. We're gonna start with what you guys are here for, get into the meat of it. And we're gonna go with how you get your, one of these players for free and then also how you can get more players and then we'll go through some of the best cards uh, out of this program and talk about them a little bit. So first things first here, you see the sets and this is an Antonio Gibson set. Now he's a skill position. He's gonna be one of my top players, but this is a great program. The stocking stuffer program as a whole did a lot of filler positions. If you're running a theme team, basically if you had a bad position, a need position, it wasn't sexy, it wasn't great, but your theme team needed it, they filled it with this. They did a really good job giving every theme team a player that they needed, a 92 overall player, so very usable. You got a lot of really good guards and tackles, D linemen, uh, things like that. Not a ton of skill players, but a lot of these big boys are gonna be very good for your team, especially for theme teams. Let's talk about getting one for free. Um, first of all, you can do the sets. This is an 89 overall zero chill player, 287 zero chill players, 385 zero chill players, 683 zero chill players to earn a 92 overall stocking stuff for Antonio Gibson and his power up. Now that's obviously not the free way to do it, but that's the sets to do it. So you're gonna need zero chill players. So this probably will make the training or the snow reroll today very good. So make sure you check out Up and Adam Gaming. He's gonna post a video, I know it this morning, about a really good method or coins or something that you can utilize this is basically going to add stability to the re-rolls, right? Because now people are definitely going to be paying for these 89s, 85s, and 83s, which means their prices will go up, which creates an opportunity to arbitrage, maybe using the re-roll. Like I said, I would check out Adam. He's going to have a method. I'm unfortunately at work right now when this is being posted, so I'm not going to be able to be in the game and checking it out, but make sure you guys take advantage. Now, how do you get one of these for free? They did say that they're going to provide an NCAT through solo challenges. So all you're gonna have to do is pop in, you're gonna grind some solos, you're gonna get an, a free NCAT one of these. Um, so that's really exciting. Solos are easy. We need the solos for the levels right now also. So that's super cool. Just grind your solos, get one of these for free. And we'll go ahead and talk about other ways that you can get some of these guys for free. Now let's go through the top five players to pick. Which ones should you pick? Uh, basically, first things first, if you're gonna pick a free one and you're running a theme team, pick the need for your theme team. I'm gonna be picking one for my theme team. I know a lot of people are gonna be picking one for their theme teams. These guards, tackles, they're all very good. They fit the theme team. I highly recommend grabbing one of those guys. But I'm gonna pick out five of the skill positions. We're not gonna do top five. We're not gonna include linemen in that, but all of the linemen really are pretty good. But the top five skill positions in this, if you're not looking for a theme team meet, if you just need a really good player, First is gonna be Antonio Gibson, 93 speed. He power him up to 94 speed. He's got 93 acceleration, 91 agility, 89 change of direction, 92 uh, break tackle. He's an elusive back. He was a receiving back last year, so not the best archetype, but the speed, agility, break tackle, they make this card very, very good. This is gonna be an awesome budget running back for a long time in the game with that top end speed. So that's your first one. Our second one's gonna be this Tracy Walker. Now, 93 speed, he's a zone archetype strong safety, which means you're gonna get him 94 powered up, 95, 96 speed, no theme team, 97, potentially 98 speed on a theme team. That's actually nuts. He's got 95 acceleration, 88 hit power, 87 zone. So you'll be able to get him to that 90 zone threshold. You guys know how much I talk about thresholds on the channel. And he's gonna hit high hit power, the speed really, and then the zone archetype. He's gonna get all the really good abilities for the cheapest possible. He's also gonna be a really good user. Tracy Walker usually has very good agility, very good change of direction, which is gonna make him a very good user. So make sure you check him out. Next up, now this card is crazy. Free safety Andrew Wingard is a run support safety. He's got 93 speed as well, 94 hit power and 89 zone coverage. Basically everything I just told you about Tracy Walker, you have on Andrew Wingard, but better except for man coverage. Better tackling, better hit power, better 
speed or the same speed, better acceleration, way better zone coverage. That two points is huge because it's going to put you right at the threshold without strategy cards. And then the man coverage, but who cares about man coverage when we're talking about these guys. Andrew Wingard is probably my favorite. I think he's going to be the best one, honestly. And he's got really good size, so that's exciting. Juan Thornhill, another safety. I know we're going DB heavy in this one, but the last one's not a DB. Juan Thornhill, again, we talked about that zone archetype. 92 speed, so not great, but he's got 89 zone and 86 man coverage. So the coverage stats are what makes this card really good. 92 acceleration, 88 pursuit, 88, 86 hit power on Juan Thornhill. That's super exciting. He's going to be really good as well. And then again, you have your zone archetype there, which is going to help out with the chemistry. Now, this card is a sleeper. Wide receiver Tim Patrick, deep threat. Broncos receivers are getting some love. We're, so, we're at that 93 speed number. So again, 96, 97, 98 speed. You're going to be able to get him up to 89 jumping, but 92 catching traffic, 90 deep route running. He's going to have 90 spec. He's got good 85 and 84 short and deep, medium route running. But I believe Tim Patrick is six foot three or six foot four to go along with really high end speed on a 92 overall card. This is only going to cost you like 120, maybe 130,000 coins. So that's really exciting. That's a super, super good upgrade. Tim Patrick is going to be a sleeper card from this promo. Now I'm going to go through the two masters really quickly and talk about both of them. And then I'll give you my theme team sneak, the little sneaky tip here at the end with the theme teams. CD Lamb, we finally, you've talked about this 93 speed this whole time. CD's got 94 speed, so 95 powered up, 96, 97 with the uh, strategy cards, 98, 99 with the Cowboys theme team. And the Cowboys theme team is one of the best theme teams in the game. So 99 speed on that theme team is crazy. You're also gonna hit all of your thresholds on route running, 90, 90, and 93 if you have a strategy card or power them up. 90 catching, 93 jumping, 92 catching traffic, 94 spec. This CD Lamb card is cr is crazy. So make sure, I don't even know what else to say about that. Now the last one, there's a bunch of things I wanna talk about on this JC Jackson card. So we're back at that 93 speed, but that's awesome. 93 speed, 95 acceleration. He's gonna hit 90 agility if you can power him up a little bit. 94 man and 90 zone. So he hits both thresholds, not powered up on man and zone. I would really make sure you power him up or get a strategy card for the agility though. That's really important. But JC Jackson, now there's two things I wanna talk about here. The first one is he's listed at 5'10 in the game, but on pro football reference, which is what everybody's, Kralo said on Good Morning Madden that they use pro football reference for physical and team chem stuff. So if they're looking for height, weight, and team chemistries they and positions as well, they look at pro football reference. Pro football reference has him listed at six foot one, but he's only 5'10 in the game. So if they bump him to six foot one, JC Jackson's gonna be insane. Now the other piece, the sneaky tip, is that JC Jackson has a Gridiron Forge card, which means he gets times three Patriots chemistries from the Gridiron Forge. So the Patriots theme team has a times three in JC Jackson and a times three in Kevin Falk. If you're running a Cowboys theme team, you've got the same story with Zeke and with their team at Builder. And then the same thing with Cam on the Panthers. So keep that in mind with those Gridiron Forges as they give you times three team cam. So the Patriots theme team just got really juiced with this JC Jackson. And then uh, I'm obviously also gonna be running a theme team. So tell me guys down below which player you're gonna be picking. This is gonna be a really good program. It's great for theme teams. You've got two really good masters, a lot of usable cards who are gonna be very cheap. If this video helped at all, let me, let me know down below. Subscribe to the channel. Do not forget about our 1,000 subscriber giveaway. And guys, we'll catch you in the next one.